That's going to catch people off, off guard. Surprise, you know I mean? Fake one. Fake one. Fake one. Fake one. Fake one. Now, after you bridge and you come back out, I'm going to rush you. I want you to check hook off the knee. Right there. Okay. Let's do that again. I'm not going to throw the, I'm not going to throw the jet back at you. So we'll just bridge. Boom. Boom. Yes, exactly. Good. A little more snap in the hip. Finally, turn the hip. There you go. That's it. Space, right? So if you're just standing right there and I'm coming at you, you're right here, right? Exactly. You step back with that foot, you're creating a little more space, giving yourself a little more time to set up that backhand hook. Okay. We're popping that hip right there. Okay. So it's one back, back. Foot. Exactly. You're gonna come back to your starting position first. Okay. And then go home. Okay. Think of it like this: boom, boom, boom. Okay. okay. Like music. Yeah, fake for you. Turn the hip over a little more. Bam. Here you go. You're shorter than your opponent, right? Let's say your opponent, you know, you're facing a girl who's a lot longer than you. You know, most people you box probably will be a little bit taller than you, right? You can still beat them with the jab, but you can't stay on the center line, okay? So let's say me and you are boxing, I can reach that far with my jab. Stay on the center line now. Now reach out with your jab, right? So I'm gonna get there first every single time, right? But if you're moving your head off the line, now when I throw my jab, you can, you know, make up for that difference in, in length by being off the line when those jabs come, okay? So what we're gonna do is this. You're gonna slip jab off to your right. Boom, right there. Okay, good, again, good. I'm gonna throw it again, you're gonna slip jab off to your left side. Right there, okay? Boom, boom, right there, again. Good. That's it right there. Good. Good. Nice work. Good. Good. Now this time when you slip jab, I want you to close the distance on me a little bit. Okay? So we're just gonna do one slip jab and we're gonna alternate sides, but every time you do it, you're gonna step in with me. Close the gap. Okay. Right there. Now get to me. Don't step back out. Okay? Now we're trying to take that space and get inside and work from a closer range. Okay? So get up and take that distance from me. Right there. Even closer. Okay? Good, like push off that back foot, get to me. Good, good. Good. Okay. The other way or? Yeah, just we'll keep going this way for now. We'll switch out this. Right, yeah, good. Good. Perfect. Good. Now let's go the other way. Okay? So now you're gonna slip off to your left side, still pushing off that back foot. There you go. Good. Again. Good. 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 
good. Make sure when you get to the inside and you use your bank, you have a good foundation, you're ready to work, okay? Because a lot of times when you get there, you're only gonna have a split second to get that working. Okay, you gotta let your hands go immediately. Because as soon as they get uncomfortable, they're gonna be moving out, okay? So you get to that spot, you're ready to go. Right there, good. 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 Jab. So I'm gonna throw it at you first. You're gonna use like a counter punch, right? Underneath and straight up. Now, don't go down, come up, and then throw the jab. We're gonna imagine, imagine like you're doing a, a medicine ball throw, right? We're squatting down, we throw it on the way up, right? We're using our legs. So when I come down, boom, use your legs to come up with the jab. Generate more power with it. Right there, again. Good, let me get next up with those shots. Things don't feel good either if you get hit by enough of me mess 